What's up guys? Freaking chocolate here and today people, today we are in week four, I believe. Week four of the uh, FDL, the Phalanx Draft League. This week the Sunny Coast Lazars are going up against the Super Seal Stars and their stand-in coach, Coco for days. Um, not gonna lie, we've put this match back quite a bit because life is busy. And I haven't prepped too much. Um, I don't know if it was because we got the dub last week um, by going straight up uh, offense and not thinking about another thing, but just going pure attack. Uh, but I liked the way we played doing that. So uh, knowing Coco, he is also the kind of uh, player who will he'll look for strategies he'll look for cheeky little strategies um which i'm hella excited for to see what this team will bring however though we are here as i said for week four of the fdl we are going up against coco he is usually my podcast partner for Drupal Live city radio but today we are versing each other so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go over what i'm going to be bringing going over what he's going to be potentially bringing um, we'll connect with our opponent. We'll have some fun doing it. And hopefully the Sunny Coast Lazzles can bring home the dub. All right. So the Super Seal Stars are going to be bringing the potential of Hydreigon, Seraledge, Hariyama, Klefki, Paldean, Taurus, the Fire Form, uh, Scovillain, Frostlass, Holucha, Persian, and Bombardier. Um, I have never seen Scovillain in battle. I've never seen Bombardier in battle. So that should be interesting to see if they come. What I do think he's going to bring is the Hydreigon, the Seraledge, the Hariyama, the Klefki, the Taurus, and probably the Persian. Uh, I know Persian does have that fake out pressure, which is a little bit annoying. Um, and it's got Unnerve, I believe, to stop you eating berries. Which isn't too hard for me to deal with, but uh, we'll see. The uh, the Hydreigon could obviously be the Steel Terror or the Fire Terror. Uh, Sarah Ledge, just a threat in general. Very hard hitting. Hariyama, um, behind a Trick Room, can do a lot of damage. I'm hoping I don't have to deal with the Trick Room because I didn't bring Trick Room myself. I'm hoping that because he's seen my team, he's not going to think um, about bringing the Trick Room, which... We'll see if that happens. Uh, the Clef Key, obviously, for Prankster shenanigans, and the Paladin Taurus hits like a truck. What I am bringing, however, you can see him on screen right now. We are bringing Children with the Citrus Berry, Stacey's Mum with the Focus Sash, Prince is back with the usual set, as opposed to last week, more of a support set with the Light Clay. Fernando, we are bringing with the Choice Band. Uh, Puff Daddy with the Life Orb and Bertha with the Rocky Helmet. Let's go into the movesets real quick before we connect with our opponents. Uh, usual set with our children, Tailwind, Strength Sap, Shadow Ball, and Will-O-Wisp. Um, pretty straightforward. Strength Sap comes in pretty hard here because uh, he's got a lot of physical attackers other than the Scovillain and the Hydreigon. Um, everything else is... Physical, I believe. Frostlass, maybe, but I don't think Frostlass is coming. Um, our Stacy's mum is rocking the D-Gleam, the Aura Sphere, the Energy Ball, and the Protect. Um, now that I think about it, Energy Ball can probably go. I will... What do I replace it with? I don't know. Maybe... Pro no, I was going to go Protect. I don't know. We'll have a think about it before we get with our opponent. Um... Our Prince is bringing the Fake Out, Reflect, Light Screen, and Spirit Break. We are doing dual screens uh, this week. We did get, uh, not last week, but the week before, we didn't bring dual screens, and it really hurt us. Uh, Fernando, with the Choice Band, we are rocking the Close Combat, U-Turn, Throat Chop, and Brave Bird. Uh, the, the plan is to just, what, we're going to lead with, Prince and Fernando. We'll set up a screen or maybe fake out, depending on what we see. And we're just going to attack something. Because a choice band Brave Bird from this Flamingo can take out pretty much every member of his team. 
um, barring the clef key. And mm, yeah, just the clef key. Uh, it, it will one-shot the Hydreigon. It'll definitely one-shot if I tear it to flying. Um, it'll take out the Serral Edge regardless of uh, whether or not I um, Terra. Could also Throat Chop. That could also do the job. Um, where are we? Uh, as I said, it doesn't take out the Clef Key, but that's okay. Uh, Paldean Taurus gets one-shotted by it, by this bird. Uh, Scovillain gets one-shotted. Frostlass gets one-shotted. It one-shots everything. Um, as long as we lock ourselves into the right move. If we don't see what we want to see at the front, like for instance, a Clef Key and a, uh, I don't know, something bulky, um, we will probably just U-turn out of there, but we'll see how we go. Uh, the aim of the game is for Fernando to pick up some kills. We want Fernando to get some wins under his belt. Uh, we are bringing the Puff Daddy, which is the hyper-offensive Puff Daddy with the Extreme Speed, Stone Edge, Fire Punch, and Outrage. Uh, and we are bringing Bertha with the Icy Wind, Chilling Water, Body Press, and Iron Defense. Um, not much to say about it. He's just there as a bit of a bit of a threat in case he thinks I'm bringing the the Trick Room again. I don't see myself bringing Bertha, but we will see how things go. We will see how things go. Anyways, let's connect with our opponent. Let's see if we can bring home the dub for the Sunny Coast Lazzles. Let's go. All right, all right, all right. What did he bring? The Hydreigon, the Clef Key, the... Oh, we get to see the Scoville and the Frostlass. Let's go. Uh, Sarah Ledge, the Hariyama. So no Taurus. No Taurus. What else missed out here? We also are missing the... Uh, the Persian. No Persian. Okay. All right, well, what do we do? What do we do? What do we think he's gonna lead? Um, He's probably gonna set up his screens of his own. I haven't done the calc about this. I know if he sets up the reflect, we can still close combat for the dub on the Hydreigon. But let's do this. This is what we wanna do. Let's just roll with it. Uh, in the back, we will bring Puff Daddy and it's more special this team. So we're not going to bring children. We're going to bring Stacy's mom and we will see where this gets us. I'm curious to know if it's just going to be the Clef Key setting up the screens and the Hydreigon lead. Terra into something? I don't know. I'm so keen to see what happens here. If he does... Okay. Scovillain and Hariyama. Um... Do we fake out or do we reflect here? I kind of want to fake out the Hariyama and I don't want to Terra just yet. I'm going to Brave Bird that as well. Is he going to Terra? No, the Sko Villain protects. Double protecting? Nope. Well, that is the most ideal situation for us. How bulky is that Hariyama? Not bulky enough. Flamigo! Fernando! You get it first kill. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Was that Spadef? I think it was. Spadef went up and attack went down. Frostlass, the Snow Frolicker. Um, if that's the case, I might set up a light screen here. And a Brave Bird on the Sko Villain.
All right, he does terror. What is terror? What is terroring? The Sko villain into a dark type. I think this will still kill. I believe this will still kill. That's okay. We were coming for you anyway, my dude. We are choice banded. We are, ooh. 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 Ah. Uh... Okay. Turns out Frost Lass is quicker. That is a quick Frost Lass. Um, what do we want to do here? Um, we might bring Stacy's mum to the party. And we're going to spirit break the Sko villain. And... Um... We forgot to change energy ball. That's a little bit awkward. I might just protect this turn. Let's see if he goes for the Frost Breath again. Okay, that's fine. What do we see? A Frost Breath? Probably Scarfed. I don't know how quick Frostlass is. We love a good dead turn. Ooh, speed. Defense dropped. That's okay. Uh, let's go ahead and spirit break it now. Um, and we don't want to bring Puff Daddy on that. I am Ghost Terror. Um, we're just going to D Gleam. Are you going to dub double us? No, you're going to take that. Very well. Very well. And this Spirit Break should pick up a kill. All right. What's his last mon? What is thy last mon? Giddy. Hydreigon. Giddy the Hydreigon. All right. Well, that is A-OK -okay in our books. We will spirit break that and D-Gleam. I think that's the right play to do. Stacy's mum missed... We heat wave. Interesting. Life orb had Dragon. All right. Game one goes to us. I should have counted my 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 KOs. Flamigo got one. Uh, Gardevoir got one. Let me see if I can type this down real quick. Uh, Flamigo. Gardy. Um. And I think Grim got two, yeah? Grim got two. GG Games won. GG. All right. Uh, same team. Did I ch click change teams? I don't know. I am not the sure. All right. Um, how do we do? We readjust. Do we do the same thing? I think I want to. I'm gonna. I didn't even terror that turn. I'm gonna terror Fernando this turn. 
uh, Prince. I think our fairies are pretty good against this team. Um, Stacy's mum and Puff Daddy, I think. I don't think we need to change anything. I do not think we need to change anything. Does Coco change anything? I think he probably does change his lead. But I'm not sure what to. I am uncertain. Let's see. Let us see what happens. Man, this music is fire. Straight fire. Serral Edge. It's the Serral Edge. Um, also, Rage Power is a thing. So... We are going to Terra Brave Bird the Serral Edge. And we are going to fake out. Does fake out happen before the Rage Powder? Um, we're going to set up a Reflect. Terra Flying Fernando! They could have made the Terra Flying thing so much cooler than balloons. Oh, it did protect. That's annoying. It means you didn't Rage Powder. The double protect. Alright. Well, we get up a free Reflect, which is kind of nice. And I... Or do we go for the double screen now? <laughs> We're going to Bray Bird it again. Um, I might go for the last screen as well. Withdrew the Serral Edge. It is the Hydreigon. Let's see. That's not what we wanted to see, though. All right. Well, that's that is a dead Sco villain if I've ever seen one. That is the deadest of Sco villains. We do need to ask ourselves, though. Oh, hold on. That's a... Flamingo's got the two. Guardy's got the one so far. And Grim with the two. Um... Oh, we get out speed here. That's right. Don't we? Um, he hasn't terrored yet. Let's attack the High Dragon anyway. It's probably going to terror this turn. But we'll see what happens. Fire or steel? Fire. Fire! Alright. Well, that's not ideal. Not ideal. Oh, that's not ideal either. Oh, Puff Daddy! The crit! Oh, it's always a crit. He's going to pick up a double KO here too. Not ideal. <clears throat> Not ideal at all. Um, I 
Um, we're going to bring in Stacy's mom. And I'm going to... I think I've got to protect... How many turns of... Trick Room. We've got plenty of turns to deal to play with. I'm going to protect and Spirit Break the Frost Lass. Brilliant. Brilliant. The double into the Guardi. How much does this do? At least half? Oh. It's not half. Um... I'm just going to de-gleam to get a bit of damage off. And we're going to Spirit Break the Frost Lass again. It's not what you want to say. Oh, the Tailwind. That is not good. That is not good. We need to get rid of that Frost Lass, man. I don't think I outspeed it in this. Um, I don't think we outspeed the Hydreigon after that Tailwind is up. Okay. Forgot Sarah Ledge was around. All right, that is a dead frost last now, but the Serral Edge is Spirit Break was disabled. Well then, it appears we have not got any moves. Um. Um, 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 um. I got nothing here. Nothing. Oh, the burn. Let's see how much this Aura Sphere does to the Hydreigon. After the life orb damage. Oh, we're not going to attack. Oh, we lived! You have got to be kidding me. Can we one-shot this? Oh, the tailwind's up. That's right. Ah, it's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. Oh, that's GG's for game two, I reckon. GG's for game two. Just out of curiosity, how long was Tailwind left? Oh, it's the last turn of Tailwind too. We needed to... <laughs> we needed to get that. Uh, let's go ahead and Throat Chop. And... I guess I've got a light screen. I can't do anything else here. Do we outspeed anything? No. That's GG's. Oh, Fernando! Do we outspeed the Sarah Ledge?
Not. Nope, nope, nope. All right, GG's bro. Let's take it to a game three. Um, what are the, yeah, that, that's a, it's a bad luck on my part there, but also probably shouldn't need the luck anyway. Um, Same teams. I don't think I got... Do I, I got one kill in that game. And it was the Flemmy goal. Um... I... What was that curse body us? It was the frost last, wasn't it? The switch out to sack to bring Fernando back was not a good play. Um Besides a scope villain, oh, actually, he does hurt us with the the bitter blade. Um, I'm thinking in my head here. Hmm. I'm going to bring Bertha. I'm also beginning to think maybe I did need to bring the speed. Um, the tailwind myself, but we'll see. Scovillian, Scovillain and Frostlass are again. Um, let's, I should have brought the goggles. I didn't know he gets rage powder. Um, we will brave bird. Or we'll throat chop. I'm going to... Oh, jeez. We're just going to Brave Bird that and uh, set up the Reflect. Did I get that? Oh, we protect it anyway. Oh, that's not a... Oh. How much is the Frost Last going to do? Uh, the Frost Breath going to kill us? It doesn't. Um, right. Right. All right. Let's switch into Bertha. And we are going to... Set up a light screen. You know, funnily enough, 
Was that Icy Wind? Was that... No, yeah, that was Icy Wind. That wasn't Frost Breath. Wait. So he's not Scarfed? Um... Do we think he's got the grass move on the Scovillain? What's in the back? Stacy's mom. I'm gonna def I'm gonna defensive Terra here, and I'm gonna icy wind. Now let's body press that and spirit break that. Just don't curse body us, please. Please. Let's see if he's got that grass move. No, you're gonna protect that. Did I double into that? No, I didn't. Okay, cool. Um, we are going to... Um, I'm going to Chilling Water... No. I'm going to Icy Wind. I'm going to Icy Wind here just to drop that speed. And I'm going to spirit break the frost lass. Let's uh let's not get the curse body happening. Oh wow, that doesn't have the grass move. Oh, I don't know if a frost breath will kill this now. An icy wind I meant, not a frost breath. Grimmsnarl has become a burden. A burden. Um Alright, we're gonna icy wind again. I don't think we have speed still. Um, and we've already got both up, yeah? No, we don't have the reflect up yet. May as well do that. Oh, what are you doing here? Playing throw on that too. Yeah, that was a smart play. I think we lose. I think we lose. To a Scovillain and a Frostlass. Who would have thought? Defense rose sharply. Um... I don't know what to do here. Because we're going to see a Rage Powder. Um... <laughs> Throat Trop will kill that, but I don't think it matters.
Let's just... Oh. No, we're going to Brave Bird. The Sko villain. And light screen because we are disabled. Did that one frost breath count? It did. We get not even the kill because we're not. Yeah. Yeah. And a flamethrower. Um, Spadef, no, nope. no. All right, well, we lose this game. We're going to D Gleam and Spirit Break. No, but it's disabled. We can't, we can't do anything. We can't do anything. Are we faster? We are. No crit though. No crit though. All right, Guardy got two kills. Spicy extract. Hey, we're no longer disabled. That is massive. Not massive enough though. Um, <laughs> what are you going to do here? Let's. Let's protect. And we're going to spirit break the Scovillain. The Shadow Sneak and... The Flamethrower into it. All right, let's hopefully get rid of this. Oh, that's absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Defense Rose, Speed Fell. Um... Can we survive a shadow sneak? We can with a with a with a sash. Let's pick up a kill. Oh, not even. Not even. All right, Grim gets another one. Wait. No, Grim doesn't get another one. Light screen wore off. Moody's gone up. I think that speed probably gets him this game like straight away now. Um, we protect and we spirit break the Scovillain. Did he predict the protect? Negative. Can we pick up, uh... We can. Maybe. No, we can't. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man.
Um, we're going to go for double protect because why not? Oh, the double protect. I think the lefties is enough to like... Do we die a plant over here? We've been dropping that. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, Grim. It's doing as much as the lefties are. That is hilarious, man. Insane. Uh, let's Aura Sphere that and Spirit Break that. Ah, uh, GG's, bro. GG's. My Grim became a burden. Well played. Ah, uh, well, we um, we we got some dubs with the with the Flamigo. We got two kills from Flamigo, uh, two from Guardian, two from Grimstyle. But it was not enough to secure us the victory. Um, next week we do have Spring, however, so that should be a fun battle. Um, what could I have done differently? I don't know not brought prince maybe i don't know it's um i don't think trick oh, trick room might have helped us i guess uh but i think we needed the camera up to come uh oh well <laughs> anyways so i'm gonna get the heck out of here thank you so much coco for the battles and thank you for standing in uh, as a coach for the super seal stars super star seals whatever they're called. Anyways, though, we are going to get the heck out of here. Thank you all so much for tuning in and watching me lose. But the Sunny Coast Lazzles are going to try and turn it around next week. We are nowhere near the end of the league, so we can definitely claw our way back into it, especially after the win last week. We are 3-1, though, so let's see how we go. Anyways, we're going to get the heck out of here. Thank you so much. Peace out, y'all.